Hey. <sighs> it's kind of weird because I don't know when I was a kid I used to be like amazed and like kind of like intrigued by how so many adults could just like ramble on and on just talk about stuff and I had like nothing to talk about but that's like when you're really young and like the more you like encounter problems and stuff the more you could just like keep talking and just like rattle off like so many things you just like are ranting about or just so many things in your head obviously it's kind of hard to do in front of camera but I don't know, I'll be ranting to my coworkers and everyone all the time. So what am I thinking about today? I don't really know. Um, I usually sleep at like 10 p.m., 11 p.m. But it's like 2 a.m. right now. I don't know, just like watching TV and stuff. I don't know, I just feel like... Kind of like a failure, to be honest. Just like... In high school, or like in high school, it's like high school sucked, but it's like I'm gonna look towards college to be able to do the things I want to do. So it's like hope, and I think hope drives you. And like I did a lot of things to prepare for that possibility, and like I feel like I bettered myself a little bit or a lot. It's all relative, but and then when I when I got into college is like a lot of hope and a lot of trying to hang out with people and like do different things and like I don't know I wish I grew around like more people I don't know I just feel trapped in the house every day when I was at home and college felt like the time to get out but I just didn't have the money to, to like actually go anywhere and I just kind of wish I did and that's kind of regretful and it kind of sucks knowing that you got regrets and like I'm like 23 and like could have done something different five years ago or something, but like I didn't have any money and I still like hold by that. Like paying for college and stuff is just like crazy expenses and like parents or whatever say they will help you, but like you know they don't have a plan. It's like how am I gonna be in debt for college when I know I have to support my parents and myself, you know? Oh, I'm gonna I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe I'll tell you about the last time, but I want to do a bunch of creative things. It's like a big thing in my like that I feel all the time. Just I get jealous of people who are good at drawing or good at playing instruments or something. Because I feel like my parents told me no to all that stuff all the time when I was a kid. It's not like some like, strict Asian parent thing. It's like I think they just had issues, like major issues. And that's people, bro. Like, I feel like I relate more to, like, a type of, I don't know. Like, someone just grows up and, like, parents don't even think you're going to be shit, kind of. And just, like, I don't know. They, they try to tell, I don't know. I think about the parent thing a lot. Even though I'm an adult now, I should be able to control whatever, but. Kind of sucks, but I just wish I wasn't around them every single day, you know? Like, I feel like if I moved out, like, for two or three years or something, just establish myself, then, like, I'll be able to do something, you know? Like, I could help them after, but I just feel like I never got that opportunity. It wasn't, like, their fault always. I don't know. I should have moved out, like, four or five times, and, like, it fell through for one reason or another, but... I don't know. I feel like if I had like a year or two of just being around ambitious people and just like I'll be able to accomplish something. Like it feels kind of shitty like I think the worst thing about feeling oppressed is just that you don't care about others really because you're just investing in your own problems. And I feel like I have the capacity to be empathetic much more than I am right now. But I just worry about myself too much.
就是